What is going on everyone? Today, we are starting a new series. I have never watched Blank until today. A new series in which I will be reacting in a different style than I did with Adventure Time and potentially even with Rick and Morty and Spongebob. This one's gonna be a lot different because sometimes I'll be tackling one episode, maybe the pilot episode, Maybe I'll be tackling three episodes. Maybe I'll even contain the entire first season of whatever show it is. And this could reroute into a episode by episode reaction series, or maybe just more of this style of whether it's one episode, three episodes, the whole entire season. I am not sure yet. We'll see how this goes. I'm experimenting sexually and physically. Anyways, so today's first one is Futurama. We will be tackling the pilot. I've never seen Futurama. I have never been one to go for that creator style. Just as a kid, it never appealed to me. Even when I was watching Family Guy and South Park, it's still, those shows just never did it for me. But I am now in a weird, different place in time where I am interested in watching it. So for those who want to watch the entire episode of the first season, it's gonna be all on Patreon, so follow me there, down below. With that being said, that's enough of an introduction. Let us get to a new series, Futurama, Season 1, Episode 1, Space Pilot 3000. Alright. You stink, loser. Hey, Fry, pizza going out. Come on! Fry. I'm, I, I've seen this guy's face so, everywhere. Michelle, baby, where are you going? It's not working out, Fry. Oh, I put your stuff out on the sidewalk! Oh, I, 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 I know that voice actor. I hate my life. They got him. I always thought by this point in my life, I'd be the one making the crank calls. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, a thousand years? Is this what the dude? It's so cool. Oh, wow. This is amazing. I'm a sucker for the passage of time con uh, ideas and things. I love how they just started that. That's wow. Yeah, that's brilliant. Like, what a wonderful way to just show off that he's already, like, not caring about his life. And then... He's in a time machine. Or a capsule. I'll never see any of them again. <laughs> she had no girlfriend. Yeah. That's the, that's the way. Welcome to the world of tomorrow! Why do you always have to say it that the way? world of tomorrow. Haven't you ever heard of a little thing? Good afternoon, sir. Hmm... Ooh. Name? Uh, Fry. I'm Leela. Leela. Now it's New Year's Eve. Question? As long as it's not about my eye. Uh, <laughs> it's about my eye. Sort of. <laughs> Hi. I'm an alien, all right? Let's drop the subject. 3,000. Is that Blimp oh, when the year 3000? December 31st, 29. Oh, nice. Deltron. Why is that 2030? Beginning to suspect my girlfriend might be cheating on me. Now strip naked and get on the probulator. Damn. That's great. That's great. What's the little guy's name? Professor Hubert Farnsworth. Hubert Farnsworth. Okay. Loser. What's that? Your permanent career assignment. Aww. Delivery boy. Same as before. No, not again. <laughs> See you in a thousand years. Oh my god. No, because you know that like, that's what you went through, you know? Can't do that. Uh, Crosstown Express? Oh, that's so awesome. Imagine that. You just, just say. We want to go to. I mean, maybe, maybe the pipe isn't fun, but oh, Bender! Whoa, a real I'm sorry, I haven't. A 
met him yet. Cheesy New Year's costume. So, oh, <laughs> what? Oh my god. At 25 cents to do that? I mean, like, you still gotta pay for suicide. That's kind of morbid. This robot wants to die. Bender. Okay. Um, I finally meet Bender. And I, I met Fry, Bender, Leela. You are now dead. Thank you for using Stop and Drop, America's favorite suicide booth since 2008. <laughs> 2008? I haven't seen those around. Welcome to the world. Welcome to the world of tomorrow. This is unacceptable, Leela. Really? What do you do, Bender? I'm a Bender. I bend girders. That's all. Bend I'm girders. To do. I mean, but I couldn't go on living once I found out what the girders were for. Oh. What? Suicide boots. It was a pleasure. Okay. Me. I'm gonna go kill myself. <laughs> what? You're the only friend I have. You really want a robot for a friend? Yeah. This yeah. Is cool. Ever since I was six. Well. Okay. But I don't want people thinking we're robo sex. <laughs> You're my debugger. Debugger. <laughs> What's a uh, pet fish heads or pet heads that are feed like fish? That's awesome. <laughs> Matt Groen. Oh, the creators are. That's funny. Get twenty fourth century on his ass. Twenty fourth. What? They naturally just have lifesavers. Oh, never mind. Please, please, officers. That's our job. We're peace officers. <laughs> yeah, you know the law. The purpose is, what do I look like, a D-bender? <laughs> Who cares what you're programmed for? If someone programmed you to jump off a bridge, would you do it? Yeah. I have to check my program. Probably. Yep. Yep. Oh. Right. From now on, I'm going to bend what I want. When hey, I nice. I Robot learning autonomy. And liberation. Oh. <laughs> you should have bent everything. It's the decaying the mushroom war. <laughs> Sorry. Welcome home, pal. It actually looks exactly like it. Oh, right, it's okay. This brings back a lot of memories. My God, she's gone. Everyone I ever knew or cared about is gone. Wait, there's someone. They've gone. been gone. Hey. Home, no family, no friends. <laughs> the world is gone. My parents abandoned me here as a baby, and I don't even know what galaxy they were from. Mm. Feels to be alone. Leela. Look, Leela, I don't understand. So I give up. Mm. If you really think I should be a delivery boy, I'll do it. Mm. I just never realized it until I met you. Huh. That's interesting. What is the matter with you? I just wanted to be <laughs> stole my ring. Sorry. Well, that solves the mystery of the missing ring. <laughs> Can we have some money? Oh my no. No. Let parallel park. I see some fan service moments there. Stole it, take off the jacket. That's the Dutch shot. The year 3000, yeah! Bro, I, I will never see the year 3000, that's crazy. I'll maybe see 2100, maybe. Oh, those poor sons of... but that's not... <laughs> the important thing is, I need a new crew. Okay, well, some backstory there, maybe. Yes. Content of space swap stomach. <laughs> this is awesome! Monsters and teaching alien women to love. Hey. If by. Oh, then yes. It's a little home business. I mean, I started to they, like you're business. still like delivering. Cool. What's my job gonna be? Possible for ensuring that the cargo reaches its. <laughs> so I'm gonna be. Uh. All right. <laughs> I'm a delivery boy. I guess it's different because you're in space. And you get to travel the world, like I guess. The galaxy. Alright! 
I have popped the Futurama Cherry. And that was a pretty fantastic pilot. We have Fry, Bender, Leela, the grandpa's name I don't know yet, and Fry. He's kind of miserable. His life's kind of depressing. Or at least it's very mundane. And then he gets stuck in a chrono sphere thing. The hyperbolic time chamber, if, if you will. And yeah, he gets stuck there for 1,000 years. And then... The show does a good job at already showing how futuristic it is with just the way the world works with some weapons and devices, uh, the way they travel. Really cool stuff to kind of see how the world functions. Uh, just really awesome, immersive. And then, yeah, we meet the other characters. And it's cool to see how Fry is already impacting Bender and Leela because before Bender, He's programmed to do something or to just bend things. And then he's teaching him, hey, bend whenever you want. And with Leela, she's like, I always wanted to quit. I don't even want to do this. And again, meeting Fry impacted them too. Like that quickly. So we already have a nice group, a nice trio. Maybe a fourth one with the nephew. <laughs> um, but I'm a sucker for futuristic stuff with... This vibe of the show, uh, it's 100% what I dig. And the humor is a lot more, what is it? Not dry, but it's like more deadpan, if that makes sense. So I wonder how it's going to translate, but I do think it worked very well, this one. And that's the pilot. So, if you guys want me to continue this journey of Futurama, at least season one... Let me know down below and like this thing, whatever, because I think it's going to dictate whether I kind of go more into it or not. If you want to see more and or the full version of this, you go on Patreon. Most likely season one will be all in there if it doesn't end up succeeding. But that's going to be it for me. I will see you guys in the future. That's so corny, but <laughs> I had to do it.